I'm very happy to be here. Actually, I'm not happy, but sad to know your to know your plight, to know or to understand the sufferings of the people in the city of Bombay. Also, we have a number of fisher folks and also a number of slum people staying in the slums. And time and again, their houses are demolished. Their houses are demolished in the name of development. Development is good. So the question we have to ask ourselves is, development for whom? Is it for a few people or is it for the majority of the people? Is development only when the rich benefit or development is important when the poor benefit from these projects? I would like to congratulate you for taking up this issue. Because, as you said, it is the survival of the people. The people's houses and livelihoods are being threatened. And therefore, I would like to congratulate you. You may succeed or you may not succeed. But your voices of protest is being heard all over India and also all over the world. Therefore, I would encourage you that in spite of difficulties, in spite of failures, you carry on your protest. And what I find as I visit this place is your protest is non-violent. We are going to celebrate Gandhi's day on the October 2nd. And Gandhi was a person who stood for non-violence. And I would like to congratulate you because your uh, protest is non-violent, following in the footstep of Mahatma Gandhi. And therefore, I stand here in, in solidarity with all of you I had come to a college to conduct a workshop on environment and I felt that I should come here because this is also an environmental problem and therefore I stand with you, I am with you and especially my prayers are with you because God can work marvelous deeds in spite of all our weaknesses in spite of all our failures if we believe in god then surely he'll protect us he will he will see that what is good for the majority of people will be uh, implemented so once again congratulations i am with you and uh, all the best i know the protest is long it will not be over soon, but I am with you in your struggle and may God be with you. Thank you.